This morning, after volunteering at Park Run, someone burst into the uh, cafe asking where the AED was. The staff didn't know. I knew what an AED was, a defibrillator. He pointed out someone had a heart attack um, just uh, in the park. Um, what followed was, I thought, a very frustrating experience. Uh, I, I searched for Singapore AED locations and the first link um, well, was, was, a, was a very slowly loading map that uh, didn't, mm, wasn't able to locate me. So I had to, well, I knew where I was, but, and I had to track down the um, location of the, of the only AED in, in the park. Uh, oh, oh, sorry. In this side of the park, it's quite a big park. Um, which was behind the end park's office. Um, but the experience on mobile is just absolutely dreadful. Um, <laughs> like for example, I've got I've got the the modal up that tells me it was behind. Like I couldn't I didn't know where this was actually. I had I it was only by clicking the the marker I could I could get extra information. You see, you can't even get the extra information in portrait. You have to like rotate. And also when you rotate it. Um, it seems to lose your location and put you somewhere else. So this um, this this experience on mobile is absolutely dreadful. Um, another very disappointing thing is that obviously uh, on Google Maps there was no the, the, there's no uh, AEDs on Google Maps either. Am I supposed to install the app? I, please no. So uh, I, I I I did find it uh well it took me five minutes or so or to f figure out where it was on the web page and, and then and then 10 minutes to go there and pick up the aed um i also thought when you when you you have to like break a piece of glass to get the uh the key the key out like breaking the glass i almost cut myself to get the key out and then i took the uh, aed and put it into my pannier it was quite bulky uh, if it was like difficult to carry it. and so it's lucky I had my sort of pannier to carry it to the thing but it was just so frustrating because I knew it had to be very very fast because uh, your chances of surviving just just like you know uh, drop or um, as time goes on and it was just super frustrating that it took me so long to find the AED and we're living in the information age and this needs to be a lot lot better uh, and there needs to be more AEDs uh, too, I think. But anyway, by the time I got with the AED uh, to to the location where the the guy had the heart attack, I think the good news is that he seemed to well, he disappeared. I, I can only assume an ambulance picked him up. But anyway, I thought I, I should point out how awful um, information for AEDs are in Singapore. It needs to get better. Thanks, guys.